Hi, this is June. I'm showing you a shot using my cell phone of my new tarot sacred table. I'm new to tarot. In fact, I'm a really green newbie, <laughs> a green newbie, very green. I started reading up seriously about it maybe less than two months ago. And as you can see, I've amassed a large number of tarot cards, mainly because I couldn't make up my mind which one I wanted. And in doing this tarot, I decided to drop my morning paper, which I only used for the crossword puzzle, and use that yearly subscription to start my tarot journey, my education with buying some books, watching many, many videos, which I keep watching, and trying to practice some layouts. Just It's only been very recently, like the last week or two maybe, that I'm just practicing some layouts. So I have a long way to go. But why would I want to put up a website or a YouTube video? Well, I thought this was a good way for my family that doesn't live in this state or even in this country to keep track of what their crazy 78-year-old mother is doing now. And also, it was a way for me to uh, ask your input and your critiques, of which there should be many, I'm sure. So anyway, let me take you on a little journey and show you my table. So I'm going to see how well this camera is working. Okay, these are some of my crystals here. As you can see, I have this beautiful geode here, an amethyst geode, and more amethyst in my little Buddha. And there's up close, very up close and tiny is my little Ganesh. He is the god of overcoming obstacles, which I really need right now. And here are some of my books and my cards. I don't have all my cards here. And this is a little crochet thing. This is another hobby I started. Let me reach in and get this to show you what I have here. I decided to have to crochet this because I got this new deck here and it did not come with a uh, any kind of a box. So I decided to uh, make a little crochet thing for it. So then that took me on another journey to learn how to crochet again. So I will cover this deck at another time. I think it's a Lenormand deck and I got it, I believe, from Australia. It is a self-published deck and is very sweet. And as you can see, I have a great deal to learn. So now over here, more of the tarot cards I'll show you that I have. And uh, they're just beautiful. And some of these I bought mainly because I knew that they might be going out soon and not be published. So I wanted to get them now. Here's my beautiful, this crystal, isn't this gorgeous? It is a green calcite. It's supposed to create wonderful energy in the room. And here's some flowers from my garden and my new candle holder that I got on eBay. My new candle that I bought yesterday, another beautiful crystal. And here's my little, this is, I use this to sort of start my little meditation or my tower work. Here we go, let's start all over again. I, I call it my calling to the angels. But this is it, this is my little altar. And I will draw back now and show you what I have above the altar. Let's see. I have a beautiful mandala up there. There you go. Okay. So that's it for me for my first video. And I will soon be doing some card layouts and showing some of my decks. And hope I can get some wonderful help from all you wonderful tarot readers. I've just had a grand time meeting some of you here online and uh, I'm big fans of so many. So thank you again for all you give to the community and I'm so happy to be joining you in this tarot journey. Have a wonderful day. Namaste.